The Kingston and St. Andrew Football Association, Kasafa, has decided not to go the drastic route of requesting the resignation of the entire board of the JFF as requested by its member, Bulbe FC. Bulbe, in a January 10 letter, asked Kasafa to convene a special general meeting requesting the resignation of the Mike Ricketts-led administration over what it called the incompetence of local football's governing body. But Kasafa's General Secretary, Dwayne Dillon, said a different decision was taken at Friday's SGM. As a unified body, as a unified front, to not request a resignation from members of the JFF, but to form a subcommittee that will look on specific issues and challenges that we have um, with the JFF and to work with them, work through them, keep them accountable, you know, request um, a lot more transparency and accountability. Transparency, in especially as it relates to the restructuring of the JFF, we are aware that the that document has been sent off to FIFA regarding the proposals, but we are we are not aware of what is in it. We don't know, you know, what are what were the proposals. Dillon also said that Kasafa, which is perhaps the most influential association in local football, thought it would not be wise to have a major disruption in the JFF ahead of what will be a crucial year for Jamaica's football. Industry in itself needs a unified way of coming together. We have World Cup qualifying coming up. We have the Gold Cup coming up. These things have, you know, have, have significant impact on the trickle-down effect of our football. If we can be successful at the World Cup, in reaching the World Cup, we know the impact that can have. And now is not the time to be focusing on, you know, all the different things we want to come together as a unified body, work on the issues, work together with the JFF because we are all in one industry and see how best we can move the football and the, and the game forward. Dylan added that they did have over the minimum number of 18 clubs present at Friday's virtual meeting to constitute a quorum.